What explanation is there for the amazing longevity of the biblical patriarchs of Genesis in the Bible? Is there a hidden meaning behind the age of the ancient patriarchs mentioned in the fifth chapter of Genesis? And why do these numbers differ between the Mesoretic text and the Septuagint translation? The original text of the Hebrew Bible, which the Christians call the Old Testament, is called Mesoretic, as it appears after the critical work of the Mesorites, that is, the Jewish scholars who tried to preserve this text from corruption and edited its tradition. These questions had preoccupied the 19th century Swedish author, journalist, and member of parliament, Victor Rydberg, in the late 1860s. In 1869, Rydberg had drawn his own conclusions, which were published in Sweden. Rydberg's ideas attracted the interest of Samuel Birch of the British Museum, and a few years later, he published an article in the English language, Biblical Archaeology, 1877, Volume 5, entitled The Key to the Table of the First Geological Patriarchs in Genesis. The article claimed that there is a hidden astronomical table after the age of the patriarchs, and this table will include the basic numbers of that time, and especially in the archaic Jewish calendar. However, this explanation seemed improbable. The few written texts cannot confirm it. Recent archaeological finds, such as those at the Dead Sea of the Dead Sea Scrolls, seem to offer some support for Rydberg's thesis. The Dead Sea Scrolls were found at Qumram in the caves. The Sumerian writing is cuneiform on ceramic brick and has a list of all the kings from the creation of the Sumerian monarchy up to 1800 BC and the approximate date of creation of the list and they are exhibited in the Oxford Museum. The age of Enoch was 365 years, has been interpreted as a sign that refers to an astronomical time. On the other hand, the discovery of the Sumerian king list provides a possible explanation for why the Mesoretic text speaks of 10 patriarchs instead of 8. In addition, when compared to the Mesoretic text with the Septuagint translation, Rydberg noticed several important differences. Despite the fact that the ages of the patriarchs are the same, with the exception of Lamech, their ages at the birth of their firstborn differ significantly. It also says that the Mesoretic text was based on Babylonian documents. Okay, so it means that the book of Genesis of the Holy Bible was most probably based on Sumerian uh, histories and legends of the Babylonian documents. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. I've translated this for you from a Greek article. Thank you. Finally support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.